um, <clears throat> well, it's a true story uh, about a woman who had 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 a baby, um, uh, was sent to a, a nunnery because she wasn't married. She was very young, and um, the nuns had the baby adopted, and for fifty years. She doesn't tell anybody at all about it. She keeps it completely to herself. Um, and then 50 years later, she tells her daughter one day. And then they, they, her daughter actually uh, meets Martin Sixsmith. Um, and he and Philomena go in search of the child. That's, that's what it's about without giving, hopefully, without giving the end away. Well, after hearing the screenplay, um, and the story, and then being asked to, to play the part, um, I wanted very much to meet the real person because um, it's, it's, it is the most phenomenal story about this woman, this particular woman. Uh, and uh, I, I uh, got to meet her before we did the film. And although the film deals with a search for her son, um, who was taken away from her when he was five, uh, and she um, she goes on a journey to find him and and what you know what happened to him when he's grown up. Um, it is in fact uh, how she appears at the end of the film after this journey she goes on, which was the most remarkable thing I thought about her. Um, and having the chance to meet her and talk to her about it and hearing the story firsthand, that, that made it very, very poignant. And um, our responsibility very much to her was to tell the story truthfully and, um, and you know, not, not uh, exaggerate it or make it more glamorous or more depressing or anything that it was, but be true to her. And I think and I hope from what she says, that that's what we've done. I suppose what drew me in particular to the story was uh, the, the extraordinary courage and um, faith of this person. I mean, um, she, I got the chance to meet her before filming and subsequently met her many, many times since. Um, she has the most wonderful sense of humor uh, and I mean, one of the remarkable things about that, that when, when the screenplay was read to me very early on, one of the most remarkable things was that she had had this little son uh, and had kept it a complete secret to herself for 50 years. She never spoke of him. Her family didn't know. And um, she was close to her daughter and is close to her daughter, but she'd actually never told the story of him or mentioned him. And I know for a fact that she thought of him, oh, I don't know how many, a dozen times a day. Well, um, it just happened that my passion was the theatre, and is and is still the theatre, uh, simply because um, you get the chance to do it the next night and, and perhaps get it better, perhaps get the performance better. It's a, it's a working process. Um, and when it, I mean, all, whether you're, making a film or you're in the theatre, it's a process of telling a story to an audience. And um, the, the wonderful thing, as I say, about the theatre is that you could, that, that you could work at. What, um, what about filming is, I mean, filming is, a, now I, I never thought I would ever make any films, but um, I love it now, having watched a lot of people who are very, very, very good and very good at it and worked with directors who are very good at it. Um, and and um, the thing is that, that once it's there, it's there. That film will never change. So you've got, it's a, it, that's a real working process.